It's been a great and exciting year for British motor racing. At Harlow in Essex, the fun is reduced to two wheels, but there's no shortage of excitement for those cyclocross beavers. This is an international trophy race over 13 and a half miles of hills, mud, freezing streams, the lot. There are 200 competitors. And remember, this is all done for fun. You think this is a tough sport? It's even more exacting than it looks, with mechanical hazards thrown in. The circuit itself is one and a half miles of mud and slippery slopes. With each lap, after the pitter-patter of 400 big feet and bicycle tires, the going gets even worse. Prizes total over 200 pounds, and all top stars, both professional and amateur, are competing. This is a classic event in cyclocross. You could almost call it the Grand National. It's a cold day and that water's freezing. With the field stringing out, hard to know who's who and where. With the race reaching a climax, even more effort from the front runners. There are three in it at the end, but the race goes to the favourite John Atkins. Keith Murnickel is second. The things people do on bikes. The coach for the Lord Mayor of London, all two and a half tons of it, gets ready to carry 